you want it. What's up? I can tell that you want it, girl. What's up? I can tell that you Hey guys, welcome back to the Nova Show. It's your host, International Nova. I was gone for a few days, had a small case of the flu, but I'm back and we got some cool music news. So let's get right to it. Now in today's news, it's just been announced that Taylor Swift's 1989 World Tour concert film will be streamed exclusively on Apple Music. Starting December 20th, the concert film will be available to all Apple Music subscribers. Now the film itself features Taylor's entire concert, which she performed live in Australia this past November. Now in a past Nova Show episode, we did touch on the fact that Wu-Tang's new album was purchased by a mystery buyer for a couple of million dollars. Well, it's just been announced that the most hated man on the internet was the actual mystery buyer. His name is Martin Shrekley, and he's a hedge fund mogul, and he's infamous for purchasing a life-saving AIDS drug and increasing the price from $13.50 to over 700 bucks for the pill. Now, according to Martin himself, he purchased the album for over $2 million and has yet to even listen to the project. Wow. Now, in other weird news, K-pop girl group Oh My Girl has been denied entry into the U.S after being mistaken for sex workers. Now apparently due to the amount of luggage, makeup, and wardrobe, the group has been detained at LAX airport in Los Angeles. Apparently there's a huge number of sex workers flying into the US and LAX airport in Los Angeles seems to be a hotspot. Now in other news, Wiz Khalifa has just released his brand new mixtape, Cabin Fever 3. The project itself has over 11 songs and features Juicy J, Chevy Woods, and Currency. Now the mixtape is pretty hot, go ahead and check it out, it's all over the blogs and it's also available on popular music website, That Piff. Now that's it for the Nova Show, thank you for tuning in. Tune in on Friday for the next Freedom Partner Spotlight. Until then, you guys take care.